Welcome to the third in the uh, video series on hull potential. Uh, you'll recognise some of the components before. We've got a high impedance millivolt meter here, silver silver chloride reference, and the metal will be connected to the positive terminal. Aluminium before uh, gives you a potential of minus 900 millivolts. We had a, a piece of rusty um, marred steel. This gave us minus 450 in the first video. And what we've got here, we've got some magnesium ribbon. Now magnesium is the most common um, material used for sacrificial anodes in river boats, river vessels. Now magnesium itself has a very negative potential. It has a lot of electrons in it to give up to water. So I connect a piece of magnesium up um, as uh, just a positive terminal. So just to give you an idea of what the potential of magnesium is on its own, I'll immerse that in the water. Okay, you just have a look at the display itself. Now in theory, that's minus 1,647. In theory, you can see it's not a perfectly clean piece of magnesium. It's minus 1,800 millivolts. So it has a lot more electrons to give up than the other materials we're talking about. So if you add um, to our aluminium boat, we add a magnesium anode as such. We should see, you should see an increased negative result for the aluminium boat hull. So let's just look at that. Okay, so as you can see, that 900, minus 900 millivolts, it's gone now to minus 1,400. So it's not gone to the potential of pure magnesium because you've got an aluminium component there. Now your hull potential is not gonna go as negative as that because the proportion of magnesium to aluminium is very high here. Obviously your anodes are gonna be relatively low in, uh, in potential uh, or, or in terms of relative mass of your boat hull. So if we take our smaller anode here, make contact with our iron hull. This was about minus 450 before. We've added a small amount of magnesium to it. Now we're gonna immerse that into the solution. And as you can see now, you've got minus 718. Now, a perfect hull um, or a mild steel hull, unprotected is minus 600 millivolts. So obviously it's higher than the perfect hull because you've got that magnesium element. 